What's up guys? Colin from Deco Network, back with Zach Dewhurst. And this time we are in Atlantic City for the 2024 Impression Show. How you doing, Zach? It's only been about 10 days. Yep, a little bit different than um, the GPX show in Irving, Texas. Yep. You know, Impressions is kind of the leader in these shows for apparel decoration, whereas GPX has a little bit more signage and so forth. Right. Atlantic City used to always be the second biggest show of the year. And based on what we felt the last couple days, it seems like it is back to being the second biggest yeah, show. Yeah, it's been of the a year. very good show. We're on day three of three, and first two days were great. The weather's not so great today, so it's been a little slow. But overall, I've been impressed with what I've seen. Yeah, I mean, again, last year was a good show, but I feel like it's been even a greater show this year. A yep. lot of attendees, a lot of um, exhibitors showing off some really cool things that we're excited to go show you. Yeah, so let's uh, let's go walk in and see what uh, they have to offer this year. Yep, so we're in, again, Atlantic City. This is essentially our East Coast show. Um, you know, you first start with Long Beach every year, then you have uh, Atlantic City, and then Fort Worth is the third impression show. So they try to spread them throughout the country. Uh, kicking it off, we have Gildan and Comfort Colors, who they acquired a few years ago. Um, Gildan is still one of the go-to brands for the um, value and medium quality shirts. Absolutely. Um, you also have premium apparel products like LA Apparel, Los Angeles Apparel. Um, we're going to see here in just a second Cotton Heritage. Those who have not looked at Cotton Heritage, oh my, their show shirts here that are being sold or uh, being printed and given out for free are Cotton Heritage and they are nice. Yeah. We have awesome. JDS Supply here. Um, JDS is very popular for sublimation and engraving products. They also sell a lot of trophies. We need our users' help. I can only try so many times with JDS. If you want this catalog on Deco Network, we rely on our users to help convince the suppliers that, hey, we want to put you on uh, Deco Network. We don't charge the supplier anything, but they like to listen to their customers more than one of us who tries to convince them, hey, you should be on our software. Right. Cotton Heritage, they only offer premium uh, shirts. And again, I cannot tell you how much I was impressed with the first shirt I felt. Um, you go direct to purchase from them, but check out Cotton Heritage. I mean, it's high, high-end quality shirts at a very reasonable price. Um, also in here, you know, you have computer to screen equipment. You also have um, automatic uh, screen cleaning equipment. Like, yeah, here's uh, our guys at Hydro, Hydro Engineering. Engineering. Great group of guys right here. They are really the leaders. They, they created this first. Um, they do a lot of other things in other industries, but as far as the screen printing world, they're about as high quality as you can get and great products. I, nowadays, it's all about automation. There are a lot of, um, it's harder than ever to find that reliable uh, employee who's gonna stick around and the worst job in the shop is cleaning screens, you can automate it with something like hydro engineering set up uh, with their equipment. Again, you have a lot of the higher end uh, suppliers like uh, LAT Apparel. Um, we saw this machine at uh, Long Beach that was really cool. You can engrave essentially directly onto a product so you can decorate with it, and you can also essentially do reverse applique with this right. type of technology. Yeah, if you haven't already seen that video, guys, check it out. It's, it, it's incredible. It's really, really It might cool. not be practical for your business, but it's cool to watch. It's cool. I, I want one of them at some point. Um, but again, you see lots of different things. Like here we have a speed uh, tagging machine. So if you needed to tag thousands of garments in a day, that is extremely efficient at doing it. Um, so again, at the show, you have a lot of um, apparel vendors, a lot of equipment vendors, and then yeah. things in between, like Corel Draw, Corel Trainer here, who will teach you how to use Corel Draw uh, efficiently. And we are actually making a webinar with them, and we shot a video yesterday. You can outsource woven patches to a company. There's a lot of heat transfer uh, companies here at the show. So everybody from Ninja Transfers, Howard, FM, Transfer Express, uh, tons of transfers, heat applying graphics has kind of come back to being really one of the most popular ways to decorate because of the evolution of DTF. Um, again, Ninja is a leader. 
you didn't hear about ninja transfers until really just recently and um, oh my are they a big player uh, in the game uh, we have automatic bagging uh, machines so you can tag a machine you know get a piece of equipment at one booth come over here buy a bagging machine uh, yeah, from those another. always seem to be hot hot topics you either love it or hate it um, obviously you have to have the business to be able to you know want want something that big I mean it's not cheap obviously it takes up a lot of real estate but hey if you're, if you're printing thousands of t-shirts a day you're Absolutely. not going to want to fold thousands of t-shirts a day it's just not we, practical you know what though at Deco Network has everybody in the industry everything from those startup mom and pops to those you know businesses doing over 10 million dollars a year right you can be using Deco Network software to run your business efficiently and um, yeah you're going to want to um, Potentially also look at joining Shirt Lab Tribe that Deco Network recently uh, joined is now a sponsor. Shirt Lab will actually, it's a private club for decoration shops and industry experts. It's a great way to learn about the newest technology. Deco Network has been involved for around a month. The amount that I have learned in that first month has been incredible. Um, right here we have Happy Japan, Happy Japan is a leader when it comes to manufacturing embroidery equipment. As the name says, it is manufactured in Japan. And oh, they're my, happy. Oh, yeah, you're happy. But I mean, if you look at, right now they're sewing the Richardson 112 six panel hat here, and it is absolutely flying. I mean, at 850 stitches a minute, it is going on a very structured hat that is a lot more difficult than sewing a five panel uh, hat. Absolutely. We uh, had some fun here with SFX Laser, where they have two different types of engraving machines. So they have a CO2 engraving machine and a UV engraving machine. That allows you to go on to a wide range of products, including glassware, which can be a lot harder to engrave because it could crack or break, and when it has a unique shape. So again, we made a really cool video with these guys earlier today highly suggest checking it out because you know when you think engraving you often think of like an epilogue little box engraver the co2 and the uv are a different way to engrave and definitely have the pros it's just and like it printing. also could be a replacement for sandblasting we learned yep where well, it, it mimics sandblasting they were telling us that you feel that you would think it's sandblasting and it's not yep again every decoration process has a time and place you can use a lot of processes multiple ways and satisfy but if you use the right tool tool in the toolbox you're going to get a better result yeah, so, fm is right there behind you fm is Another a leader in heat uh, transfers um, again you also have some of your smaller apparel vendors um, at the show and then you have vendors here like flexfit who are selling through distributors like Sanmar, SNS, Alpha Broder, right. and they're just here to educate you about the uh, products. No idea what that's for. <laughs> um, Baradin is here. Baradin also makes Japanese-made embroidery equipment. They are a leader. Um, I have never heard anything negative about Happy Japan, Baradin, or Tajima. You can't really go wrong with any of those Japanese engineered pieces of equipment. Uh, ACC is here. Last year I approached them and about joining um, Deco Network. We now have their catalog and it's always growing. Very nice. We also have auto. We have over 500 auto hat products on Deco Network. We have another uh, hat manufacturer that's in our catalogs, Outdoor Cap. Outdoor Cap. Um, we also have PPAI, where you can learn about the promotional product industry. We're going to do a webinar with them, and we'll be at the PPAI Expo in Vegas to kick off next year. We uh, have First Citizens Bank. Highly suggest looking at them anytime that you need to uh, be financing equipment, whether it's new or used, whether it's a heat press or a you know quarter million dollar setup, they can take care of you. Um, we have m &R. Everybody loves m &R. Whenever you see their blue, all you do is think quality. Something that I've recognized, uh, and I'm not saying this way you should buy equipment, but if it is blue, it's typically a high quality product. Uh, speaking of high quality, we have Paragon here. Paragon sells really high-end um, 
wide range of shirts, uh, more of your performance wear uh, fabric. It, it's definitely kind of an athleisure wear, um, kind of your boating and yeah, other stuff. Yeah, it looks stuff. like a good fishing shirt. You want to go it, oh, fishing excellent. on a Saturday? Yeah. That, that's a perfect shirt for that. Do you fish, Colin? Uh, not really. I, I'm not a good, my dad likes to fish. I don't I like, like it. I just don't. I, I just like don't. baiting it. I don't like taking the fish yeah. off. I'm I'm not very masculine when it comes to fishing. Just like making a video, it's not what I do. Uh, stalls. You can't go wrong with anything from stalls. Goes back to that blue comment. Then let's check out. Uh, yeah, that real Pro quick. Place IQ. So, uh, stalls really has a few different companies. So you have stalls. It used to be Stalls ID, which is stalls.com. They also have Transfer Express, is where you can get the Plastisol DTF transfers. Yep. And then they have the um, Hotronics is their brand for heat presses. And Hotronics makes, without a doubt, the best heat presses. They're manufactured in Pennsylvania. Um, I've been to their facility. They just, everything is American made, high quality. The Pro Place IQ, which we made a video with with uh, Josh Ellsworth earlier today, allows you to project a design onto the platen so you can align a clear transfer uh, easily onto the shirt. So DTF always has a clear transfer, vinyl always has a clear transfer, and now you can buy stalls um, transfers clear if you would like. It costs a little bit more, but it allows you to use that Pro Place IQ technology, which again, you've got to check uh, that video out that we made. And lastly, talking about blue, you can't go wrong with Deco Network. So Deco Network is the leader when it comes to all-in-one uh, software. We have a website in which we're dedicated, directly integrated with all your major suppliers. So again, like we walk through the room, Sanmar, SNS, Alpha Broder, Auto, Outdoor Cap, ACC, I mean, the list goes on and we're always growing um, our product offering and catalogs. We just always often ask our uh, users to reach out to their suppliers to connect with us because that's who the supplier wants to hear in order to join. So you can have those products with an online design tool. You can act like you're a customink.com and then you can also provide a network of websites to your clients, whether it's for fundraising, a team store, um, ordering portal. Those sites are extremely powerful. And lastly, everything flows into one order management system where you can create quotes and orders from scratch. You can schedule jobs, raise purchase orders, organize artwork approvals. We are a, the all-in-one uh, software solution. All of our competitors only do one of the three. All the technology has been built for decoration shops and we're constantly innovating. We're releasing a brand new update. Um, started rolling out this week. You're gonna love it, and you're gonna love what is actually right around the corner as well. We're constantly innovating, we're growing our team. In the past two months, we've added uh, two catalog uh, team members, we've added three more client services members, we added a couple graphic designers as we're building a lot of artwork templates, and we've added three more developers so the technology can be innovated and built uh, even faster. So you're gonna love what is about to be released, what's around the corner, and what's gonna keep being innovated, because uh, we at Deco Network you know, pride ourselves on making the best possible uh, software and listening to our users. I have been a Deco Network user since 2010, so for the past 14 years, I've ran my shop through the software, I've watched it evolve, we only provide a great value, and we have never increased the price on a user's account. What you pay today, you can pretty much confidently know that's what you're gonna be charged years from now. And we're not like our competitors who will give you a good price and then later on greatly increase it and you're kind of stuck with them until you leave. So really we do everything right here at Deco Network. Can't say enough about the company. That's why, you know, we do this. And, and you're gonna, if you haven't checked out Deco Network, visit deconetwork.com, do a demo and you will see for yourself why Deco Network is the shop management full all-in-one software solution if you have a printing or embroidery business. Great spiel as always, Zach. And really enjoyed this uh, show. Um, yes. When we, I guess the next time you will see us will actually be in Austin, Texas for the Shirt Lab event. Yeah. Which is hopefully going to be really fun. I, I think it is. Definitely check out Shirt Lab Tribe. We're going to be doing a little marketing there, but Deco Network is one of their biggest sponsors now. 
and we did it not for ourselves as much as for our users. So our users can actually sign up for Shirt Lab Tribe uh, for only 47 a month. It's typically 99 a month, and you're gonna really uh, like it. And also in April uh, 19th and 20th, we will actually be at the DAC show in Tinley Park, Chicago, or well, right. essentially right outside Chicago, uh, Illinois. Awesome, well, I appreciate it as always, Zach, and we appreciate you guys for tuning in. And we're going to keep doing these as long as you keep requesting them. So uh, thanks for coming along in Atlantic City, and we'll see you at the next one. See you, Colin.